A trillion dollar construction boom has been at the center of China's economic rise over the last few decades. Since the 90s, China has built some insane skyscrapers, megacities, rapid transport networks, and arguably the biggest international infrastructure initiative in history. However, one rarely talked about aspect of this rise is the construction of mega bridges. As of this year, China has more than a million bridges, some of which have broken geographical and technological barriers. Connecting modern China like never before are record-breaking mega bridges, which are becoming more and more expensive to build. Starting from hundreds of millions of dollars, the most expensive one cost over $20 billion. These are some of the most impressive mega bridges in China, telling a story of innovation and a growing global ambition. We start with a bridge over the Luzi Zhang, which translates to the Green Juice River. Stretching 798 meters over the river valley, it is not as long as some of the other mega projects we'll feature on today's video. However, the Green Juice Bridge is termed an engineering marvel given its innovative design and the complexity of construction. For starters, it is the longest single tower suspension bridge in the world. Unlike other bridges of a similar length, it is held by a single tower on one side and the rest is supported by cables. From afar, the bridge looks like it defies gravity, giving the illusion of hanging mid-air without support. Then there's the rugged terrain where the bridge is built. All of the bridge's supporting elements, from the 156-meter-tall tower to the tunnel anchorage on the other end, are built upon a steep slope. With a 54-degree angle, this is the world's steepest tunnel anchor. Despite the complexity of construction, the bridge has proven vital in its remote surroundings. It has become a key cog in the 190-kilometer-long Yuchu Expressway that connects the Yunnan region with major hubs like Shanghai. Going around this river valley previously took over an hour. However, the Green Juice River Bridge has brought that down to just two minutes. Vehicles can go at high speeds of up to 80 kilometers per hour on the bridge's four-lane deck. Construction on this complex megaproject commenced in 2019 and took three years to complete, almost the same time as another impressive bridge in the region. This is the highest bridge in the world. Standing 565 meters above the Beipan River, the Dugay Bridge is one of the more surreal structures in the world. Before Dugay, the world's highest bridge was the Sidu River Bridge, also in China, suspended half a kilometer above a river. The title of the highest bridge in the world calls for an important distinction from being the tallest. A bridge's height is the maximum vertical distance between the ground and the bridge deck. Meanwhile, the tallest bridge refers to the height of the structure itself, starting from the base of the towers that hold it. That title belongs to the Milau Viaduct in France, which is 343 meters tall. Back to the Duguay Bridge, which is also called Beipan Zhang Bridge. It runs for 1.3 kilometers on the confluence of Guizhou and Yunnan provinces, reducing the travel time between the two cities from five hours to just two hours. The bridge has a curved design, which, along with its incredible height, was forced by the extreme geography of the region. Designers had to elevate the bridge's height again and again to avoid cracks in the mountains surrounding the valley. Strong winds blowing through the canyon presented further construction challenges. The design also had to account for the region's high seismic activity. More than a thousand engineers and technicians worked with motion sensors and advanced monitoring systems to ensure the safety of the bridge. Construction workers used aerospace level materials to ensure that the bridge withstands all weather conditions and natural disasters. The terrain was previously inaccessible to cars, but motorists can now enjoy one of the most scenic routes in the world. Construction of the Duguay Bridge required $147 million, much less than the insane mega still to come. At number three is yet another mega bridge that was hampered by extreme geography. The two kilometer long Qishui River Bridge connects Sichuan and Guizhou provinces at an elevation of about 350 meters at its highest point. 
It is another mountainous region serving up the harshest conditions for construction. However, the biggest construction challenges came in the form of reduced accessibility to the construction site. A cliff on the Sichuan side meant that most of the heavy equipment required for conventional bridge construction could not be moved to the site. As an alternative, the engineers decided to build the deck off-site and then deliver it in three segments to the gorge. A system of 158 cables was implemented to support the deck, whose proper placement was ensured using 3D visualizations. The three truss segments measured 1,200 meters, 325 meters, and 205 meters in length, forcing the use of further advanced technologies to keep the workers safe. Using these technologies helped the planners with the efficiency of the project. It helped reduce the bridge tower foundation footprint by a third, while also resolving 114 clashes before construction began. All innovations combined helped save 19 months of construction time. The bridge was opened for traffic ahead of schedule in 2019. Despite significant cost savings, building the bridge wasn't cheap, as the budget for this super project topped $250 million. Taking the second spot on today's video is the longest bridge in the world. The 165 kilometers long Danyang Kunshan Grand Bridge takes bridge building to a whole new level. Most of this bridge is in fact an elevated railway line that runs between Shanghai and Nanjing in East China's Jiangsu province. A 9-kilometer section of the bridge runs above the Yangcheng Lake, where 2,000 pillars and steel cables were used to support it. What makes this bridge special is just the insane size of it, with the elevation never dropping below 30 meters. The structure is designed to withstand all sorts of troubles, ranging from extreme weather conditions to earthquakes and even a hit from naval vessels weighing up to 300,000 tons. Despite its sheer size, the bridge was completed within the strict four-year construction timeline. This was made possible with a manpower reaching over 10,000 workers. Building such a mammoth structure required a major investment. However, that's not something that has deterred China from completing some of the most ambitious megaprojects the world has ever seen. This was no different, as the Danyang Kunshan Grand Bridge piled up a construction bill of $8.5 billion, or $51 million for each kilometer. But this is not even half of what China spent on the final megabridge on our list. One of China's most ambitious plans is to develop its Greater Bay Area, which encompasses 11 cities, including administrative regions of Hong Kong and Macau. China wants this region to become its own San Francisco. This requires building a robust transport network between territories, and an integral part of that push is the Hong kong zhuhai macau Bridge. At 55 kilometers long, it is the world's longest cross-sea bridge and is touted as an engineering wonder. While the link was proposed in 2003, construction only started six years later. The bridge did take nine years to complete. However, its sheer size provides some justification for the construction timeline. It is far from a conventional structure over water, as it incorporates a 6.7-kilometer submerged tunnel to avoid busy shipping lanes over the Pearl River Delta. This tunnel can be termed a megaproject of its own, as it is surrounded by two artificial islands measuring 100,000 square meters each. This was the part of the megaproject that gave its planners sleepless nights, but building the rest wasn't a piece of cake either. More than 400,000 tons of steel were used to complete the bridge, which was about five times the amount used in San Francisco's Golden Gate Bridge. When construction began, the bridge was estimated to cost an incredible $10 billion. However, years of delays and accusations of corruption meant the cost had shot up to about $20 billion. That is an eye-watering amount to spend on a bridge. But why did China still go through with a project that attracted much less traffic than anticipated? One plausible explanation lies in China's geopolitical ambitions. The top leadership in the country has always vied for greater control over Hong Kong, where pro-democracy protests have taken root in recent years. 
better connectivity with the region helps China's political ambitions in Hong Kong. However, the Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge remains an awe inspiring structure and an engineering wonder. But what do you think? Which of these mega bridges has impressed you the most? Comment your thoughts below. If you enjoyed this video, hop on to our video about the $2.3 billion innovation in Las Vegas that is already capturing imaginations of millions. The stage is set for a global disruption in entertainment with the MSG Sphere, the largest spherical structure in the world. Check it out.